Hello Bluetoothers and thanks for tuning in again on Home Baby's channel. This is going to be a very quick video about how much power the 10 liter Spider Braumeister consumes that I really recently purchased. Home Bay Brewery. I'm going to do a little test. Let's see how much power it draws with only the controller on, the controller and a pump, and the controller, pump and heating element. So I can calculate how much power the electric heat element produces and consumes. But before I'm going to try it, I grab myself a really nice homebrew. This is the Autumn Ember Ale that I brewed with the big brother over there and it's the 50 liter version. There's a new version coming out soon. More about it in the end of this video. First of all, cheers! Very quick test. First of all, I'm going to fill the Braumeister with about 4 liters of water. So I'm sure the heating element is submerged in water, so I can test it safely. I can do it with an empty Braumeister. I'm going to put the power cord of the Braumeister in this little and neat device. It's uh, called cost control. You can monitor how much power runs through it. I have a GoPro standing by so you can see the close up of it. Let's put some power on the Braumeister. Braumeister is booting, and I will show you a close up of the screen. It's finished booting and as you can see we are on the home screen now. Pump is off, heating element is off. And on the close-up with the GoPro you can see it draws about 3 watts of uh, energy. So it consumes 3 watts of energy only using the controller. Now we switch on the pump. Going to manual. Pump is on. It's the default setting. And the device that measures the power tells me it's showing 10 watts. So the pump takes about 7 watts on the default setting. The deal with this uh, new version of the Spider Braumeister is that it has a pump on it with a dial knob on it so you can adjust the flow speed of the pump and it has several um, reasons uh, when you increase the pump flow of the pump um, you have more efficiency of the world and also when using a uh, a device to pump the wort out, they sell it separately. You can set the pump on a maximum speed and so you can pump the wort um, with a much higher flow out of the Braumeister. But you can just um, tweak it a bit and set it to your own setting. So this is default setting, pump. It draws about 7 watts. So 3 watts for the controller and 7 watts for the pump, it's a total of 10 watts. Next test is to activate the heating element. Heating element is activated, pump is on, and as you can see on a GoPro, it draws the power consumption is about 1210 watts. So minus 10 of 3 watts of the controller and 7 watts of the pump, it means that this Braumeister has a heating element of 1200 watts. This was a very simple and short test. Let's switch off the pump and heating element. 
The pump setting can be adjusted and on the maximum speed of the pump it draws about 25 uh, watts. And the pump activity in this Braumeister is uh, very aggressive. Um, I show you. This is the default setting of the pump and I'm going to switch it to maximum. The reason why I'm making this video is that there are some brew tubers out there, they are not convenient with the boil that the 10 liter Braumeister produce. When you purchase one, uh, make sure you uh, purchase the new version. I guess Spidal addressed the, the, the little boil on uh, the 10 liter, previous 10 liter version and they did uh, upgrade on the heating element. It came to my attention that uh, many web shops in the Netherlands, the homebrew online shops, that they have in the details of the 10 liter Spider Brown Meister still having the 1000 watts of uh, heating element in the details. I emailed Brown Meister, uh, Spider Brown Meister support before I purchased this one and I asked them if that is correct because on their website they had uh, the specifications of 1100 watts and they confirmed that the Braumeister had uh, 1100 watts heating element. It's strange because I or ordered, I wanted to order a Braumeister uh, at one of my uh, favorite homebrew uh, supply stores. I gave them a call and I let them check the uh, box with the details on the box of the Spider Braumeister when before it's getting shipped. And on the box it is rated 1300 watts. I mailed again Spidal, the Spidal servers, service, and they confirmed <laughs> uh, it has a 1200 watt heating element. So I guess everything was a bit new and nobody uh, did know exactly the, the numbers on this uh, new device, but I'm for sure, this is the new version of the 10 liter uh, Braumeister and probably I have could seen it on a pump. I guess, correct me if I'm wrong, the older version the, or the previous version of the 10 liter version doesn't have an adjustable pump on it. But um, let me know if you're owning a 10 liter Spidal Braumeister uh, with a 1000 watt heating element if the pump is uh, adjustable. I guess this version has the new pump, adjustable, because Spidal introduced some new uh, Spidal Braumeister Plus versions with a new controller, a, uh, IP certified, uh, certified I have to say, uh, so it's um, waterproof, new connections, there is a temperature probe inside the rod the center rod with the liter markings on it, that's very nice to see. And some different uh, improvements, but you can check the website. I'm not going to make um, any product, um, what can I say, advertisement here. Just check the website. So, I really like to have the new version, but I really purchased a 10 liter version. I have 20 liter, first, 20 liter version. So the 50 liter version, somebody interested? It still has the, the new 2015 controller on it. It works like a charm. I did several brew with it. Uh, I think 8 brews, 9 brews successfully. Looks like new if somebody is interested. Please let me know because the new Spidal Braumeister Plus version with the new controller on it looks very fancy. I guess the Wi-Fi 
is also uh, integrated so that it's going to be an awesome product and I really like to have new things in my brewery to uh, test it myself. So maybe in the upcoming ones there is some new unboxing experience and brewing with some more brewing equipment here in Home Beer Brewery's Brewery. Well, I'm rambling. I need some motion lotion. Thanks for uh, watching this video. Hopefully it helps you uh, deciding when you purchase a 10 liter Spartan Braumeister. Purchase one with uh, the 1200 watt heating element. Thanks for watching. Cheers and uh, speak to you all soon. Bye bye.